Marvelous Spy Catch play Pup the Puppet Whisperer. <laughs> Perer. Oh, After a long God. day of shooting, my team and I finally wrapped up the filming of Nino and Friends Take Chicago. <laughs> Can we change the size? Oh, Speed. large. Oh, I want it large. Raw side. Let's no, that means nothing. The... Back away. Oh, all right, go. That looks better. Yay. Unlike the show where we focus on teaching children moral lessons, the movie is a musical about the character's time in a new place. Oh. Hopefully we don't have to do another musical production anytime soon. I don't think I can handle hearing Nino sing another uplifting song about happiness and friendship. But I hear nothing. I just heard something move. Huh. Speak of the devil and he shall arrive. Oh. I scan the room. But nothing. Yeah. Uh, I swear to God. I sigh and focus on tying my shoes once more. Why? I don't have time for games. I have a dinner date with my fiance to get to. Why are you tying your shoes? Yeah. Maybe if you ignore him, he'll give up. Master. Targo, shut up. But then Master. again. <laughs> Still in the desert. Master. <laughs> I'll roll my eyes. Yeah. I know it's you, Nino. Yeah, who's Nino? <laughs> He's not even trying to change his voice. Yeah. I literally don't have time for this. I have to meet Irene. Oh. <laughs> Did I scare you? You know you got me the first time, but when it's the 58th time of you jumping out of the same dark corner of the room, it gets a little old. Ah, oh, I thought I was going to get you this time. Really, I even said that I knew it was you. I sigh. You're supposed to be in the storage room with the rest of the puppets. But they're so boring. That's because they're not alive like you are. Or possessed, I'm still not exactly sure. They can't talk or move around. Which means them... Makes them. Which makes them boring. But you, I have so much fun with you. You know, gives me my arm a loving squeeze. A squeeze. So, what are you going to do? I have dinner planned with Irene. Oh. Wait. Can I come with? No. Why? You're weird. Why? Are you seriously asking me that question? You're a talking... Narwhal? Yes. You know not. One, it's a romantic dinner with me and my fiance. Two, the last time I took you out of this place, my house was completely trashed. Empty beer bottles on the floor, and there was cotton everywhere. Oh. Did I mention that you completely destroyed the teddy bear I got for Irene for our anniversary? Oh, what'd he do? I don't know, for what I was thinking, I thought he, like, puked up... Like, the stuff everywhere. Yeah, well, it was something else. <laughs> yeah, he just ripped up another thing. He didn't puke out cotton. Yes. Listen, I didn't do anything... Uh, I didn't do any of that. The only thing I'm guilty of having winning... A winning personality. So, do you mean to tell me someone actually broke into my house, which has a security system, drank all my beers, and then ripped up Mr. Brownie? Y yes. Are you also telling me that the video footage was just an elaborate deep fake of you running around and making a mess of the place too? Yes. I have heard a... <laughs> I have a hard time believing that. After you get going, Nino, I walk past Nino. Wait! Nino scurries in front of the exit and holds out his tiny stubs, which he calls arms. Hmm. I'll... Yo, know what? Stop sticking out your tongue? I'll gut you like a fish. Nino. You're 24 inches tall. The only thing you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with is a defenseless teddy bear and Kermit the Frog. Hmm. If you said that to anything else, they'd punt you like a football. Then why haven't you done that yet? I gotta get going, Nino. Carefully, I step over Nino. But master... He grabs onto my legs like a child not wanting their parent to go to work. Uh, 
You can't leave me. You have to stay here. Shaking my leg, I free myself of Nino's grasp. Master! I'll see you on Monday. Until then, for the love of God, stay out of trouble. Ugh. Nino pouts as he watches me leave the set. Ugh. Dot, dot, dot. Did, did I come on too strong? Probably. Maybe I shouldn't have threatened them. Probably. But I didn't mean it at all. I would never hurt my master. Or their dog. So that's what are you talking about a dog? Living animals are off limits for me. But anyone else is fair game. Like that stupid teddy bear, Mr. Brownie. I'm talking to myself again like a crazed narwhal. Look around the set, it's completely devoid of any life. Anytime Master leaves, I feel awful. My head sounds different. <laughs> There's nothing for me to do here, and if I wear... If I were to try to go out into the world, someone might capture me and do experiments on me. It's not every day you see an amazingly talented puppet walking around without someone controlling them. I've done everything here. I've created letters made up of letters. I've cut out of magazines to interns. Huh. I rearranged the furniture and making the studio entire supply of pens disappear. Huh. But after a while, it gets boring putting fear into interns. Hmm. None of that made me a, as happy as whenever I'm with Master. They're still really upset about that incident, huh? I guess it was pretty awful of me to do that drink drink of their beers and tear up Mr. Brown. Drink of the beers. But what else was I supposed to do? Not do all that stuff when I was at the house alone? I should have apologized. I don't think I've ever said sorry to master huh maybe if i apologize they'll take me home again and then i can be with them more huh but what about irene wouldn't she get in the way no she's important to the master she makes master happy if i got rid of her master would never want to see me again i'll be good for master first thing tomorrow i'll start being a good little narwhal good then they'll take me home and I won't be alone anymore. Hmm. Until then, I'll be waiting for you, Master. Well, I'll wait for you, Master. Well, that's the whole thing so far? Yeah, there was no choices or anything else, so, yeah. Well, it was just story. Alright, see you guys, and then that was the... I think that was a short demo thing of it. Yeah. I forgot when it's actually supposed to come out. Let me see. Oh. Uh, let's see. What, there's a like, no sound? It's supposed to come out in September. A day to remember. Yeah, for right now, I think it's just like a demo. Oh. But so, not a bad demo. September. Alright, see you next time then. Bye.